moves. Yeah. Power moves. If you get in a fight, storm out, slam the door. Don't come back. Wait like 48 hours, dude. You come back, but just don't ever apologize. Just be like, <laughs> I had an ex girlfriend. Feeling better? <laughs> I had an ex girlfriend. They'll come back. Come I had an ex girlfriend pull a uh, really hot girl. <laughs> I've been trying to say this. I've been saying this on stage, but it hasn't been working. But that like hot, really hot girls have the same energy as really tough guys. <laughs> but they're really yeah. like, what the fuck are you going to do? <laughs> yeah, it's what insane. Are you, what are you going to fucking do about it? And Dude, like, they do that to strangers. Like yeah. a hot chick will oh, yeah. talk to me after a show and I'll be like, do you want a drink? And they'll be like, no. <laughs> Why would I want a fucking drink? I'm like, holy <laughs> shit. Yeah. Hot, hot that's chick. what tough guys do. They go, you got a problem, man? Yeah. Like, I, don't, I don't know. Do I? Hot <laughs> Chicks that hot have an invisible army of dudes who would like do anything to fuck them. Dude, so it's just... like one second. All I got to be is like, help. And some guys are punching <laughs> Some in guys raining down. Yeah. On you. <laughs> just getting fucking blitzkrieged <laughs> by the entire bar because she made a damsel in distress face. Oh, yeah. Like, oh, God. <laughs> oh. <laughs> just taking ear shots. God. I got to cover my ears. There was a... This dude that was like friends with my ex girlfriend. Oh, She's not. Yeah, it, I'm she pissed was, already, dude. <laughs> <laughs> just, you're triggering the fuck out of me right now, dude. I fucking hate this. Because I know some people make friends doing their hobbies, then they end up breaking your fucking heart. Okay, you know. <laughs> Let's pull back a little. Uh, She's hanging out with this dude. His name's Z. And she's like, yeah, "I'm hanging out with Z." Fucking and Z. Like, and I was like, "All right, cool name." Uh, <laughs> And I was, I landed in LA and I was like, Hey, you know, I'll, I'll come see you where you're at. She's like, Oh, I'm hanging out with Z. Like, and I'm like, all right, I'll meet you at your cousin's house. I go to her cousin's house. This motherfucker pulls up. She gets out of the truck and he turns around and leaves. And I was like, so we're just not acting like that wasn't a major fucking problem. She's like, what? He's my friend. So he, uh, mystery, he mystery manned you. Yeah. He kept the mystery going. Dude. Dude. <laughs> I, 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 it was smoke bomb. Dude, I didn't do <laughs> internet research on this motherfucker. I was feeling shook. But that's what it is. That's like hot girl where she's like, yeah, I've got a team of them. Yeah. But then, uh, oh, the reason I said the storm out thing, she pulled a hot girl move one time when she lived in New York still. And she's like, hey, I'm hungry. Oh, no, I'm on the way home from the comedy club and I have food. I was like, I got takeout. Yeah. She's at her friend's house for a dinner party. Mm-hmm. And she's like, oh, I'm hungry. Cool. All right. I was like, no. She goes, did you get food at the cellar? I was like, yeah, I got food at the cellar. She's like, yeah, okay. Um, I'm at, I'm at uh, Evan and Emily's and they just had steak. And she's like kind of a vegetarian sometimes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I was like, oh, all right. So I get back to my apartment. She shows up. And I'm not joking. This is why I say hot girls act like tough guys. She goes, did you order me sushi? <laughs> and I was like, and I was like, what? what? And I was eating what? out of a fucking what? to go. What? I did that. I go, what? 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 <laughs> and she's like, did you order me sushi? And I was like, you're fucking with me. And she goes, I told you I was hungry. And I was like, so we get in a blowout fight. She storms <laughs> off. I don't chase her. She calls me the next day. I'm like, this better be a fucking apology. And she's like, what uh, <laughs> you didn't order me finally after like four days we work it out we're laying in bed and i'm like you know our fight was like white man can't jump when she asked for the glass of water and she's like i've never seen that movie and i was like of course <laughs> of course so i show her the clip on my phone we're laying in bed and she goes that's not funny and you're like i what am i doing it's like that hot, it's just like tough guy like what are you gonna do bitch yeah. Yeah, that's not funny. Girls love that. Fuck you're you. not funny. That's like you know you're not funny. You're not funny at all. It's like all right. No, yeah. <laughs> I'm laughing. I'm yeah. laughing at myself. <laughs> you have great walking away lines. Yeah. I'm laughing. I'm laughing right over here. I'm laughing all the way in the garage. You stupid bitch. That's why your brother killed himself. You're like whoa. whoa. <laughs> you start going. <laughs> you start getting super dark on her. Oh man. Yeah, you told me that one where you were trapped in the house during a breakup. Oh, after, dude. Yeah, that that's was, some real shit. That one was. That's like, on my Netflix special. That's a fucking Vecchione and I. Dude, hold on. You told me that. Like, so he told me the story like a day or two after. Like, I was over there, like, real bummed about my breakup, and he told me that story, and I was like, "Damn, dude, are you all right?" <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. I was instantly, I was like, "Damn, that's tough." Man. Yeah. Well, Vecchione, uh, Vecchione got broken up with his girlfriend, my roommate. Like, they were going through it. And then I had a phone call. I told Shane about it. It was like this blizzard was coming, and mm. I was like madly in love with this girl. And out of nowhere, she's just got weird. And I was like, did something happen? Ugh. And she's like, yeah, I just don't know if I want to be in this. And I was, it's the last day on a pilot I was riding on. And so it's like early. It's like 745 because you have to be there by 839. Uh-huh. So I'm like, it's, it's fucking, she was in LA. It was like five in the morning. And she's like, yeah, I just don't. 
think I should be in this. I was like, all right. Damn, yeah. that early? Uh, yeah, in the morning. Cause she, I was like, I need an answer. Oh, because she was supposed to come back to New York and we were going to talk. But her flight got, it was like a big blizzard coming through. Yeah. So they're like, no, can't. they're canceling flights for tonight. So she's like, I'm not going to make it in. And I was like, well, we got to talk about this because I can't sit in a writer's room yeah. all day being like, does she want to be with me or not? And she's like, I just don't think it's going to work. And I was like, take care. I remember <laughs> saying take care and being all like, right, fine. <laughs> <laughs> and then I called oh. Rachel Feinstein, whose pilot I was, and I was like, I'm fucked up. And she's like, do you not want to come into work? I'm like, I'm going to come into work. But I made it. It's just like one of those things. It's like when a flashbang goes off, you yeah, know, in a movie. Yeah, yeah. It's like, uh-huh. and everyone's <laughs> just talking to you. And they're like, yeah, and you're like dude, no, no. dude and I've been in a fucking writer's room the, the last it's, three weeks going through this entire thing. And I'm oh listening to God. bad jokes. Oy. Like when someone pitches you a bad idea and I'm in like oh, the worst mood possible, I'm just like, that sucks. Yeah. Your idea sucks. You're stupid. <laughs> They're like, do you want to be a part of this team? I'm like, yes. But that sucks. Yes, yeah. more than anything. More yeah. than anything I'm in so the world. I'm so happy to be here right now. Also, all I'm thinking about is how my insides are crumbling in on yeah. each other. But dude, after that fucking day, that blizzard hit that night, and I, we were stuck inside for three days, and it was like, I would just wake up and look, and it would be all white out my window, and I'd be like, <laughs> just like the fucking noises you make oh when you're heartbroken God. you're like I'd just be like I'd suddenly be like <laughs> you're dude I told you that this is real fucking sad dude yeah. the other day here I woke up mm-hmm. on the couch and I like was half dreaming about the dog coming up and like yeah, yeah. bumping me with his nose which is how he used to wake <laughs> me up and I was like dreaming about it and I was oh. like Yes, yes. And then, like, I woke up, and I was, seriously, I was like, <laughs> like, full fucking, like, you know what that is? That's and I fucking, rolled over. I that's like, in the war movies, where the hero's down, and he, he, it's his wife, and she's yeah. like, wake up, honey. Like, standing in wake the field up. of grass. Yeah, okay. it's Gladiator. Yeah. That's no. Shane's fucking dog like, running through the grass. <laughs> it's him leading his hand through the wheat. Marcus, Marcus Aurelius. <laughs> dude, I will have my revenge in this life or the next. See, dude, I'm coming in. I'd, hot, rather get, I'd rather get dumped. I'd rather get dumped than break up with someone. Oh, dude, breaking I'll tell you this. So it's breaking up what worse. it is is it's putting a gun on their head and they're like, do it. And you're like, I'm sorry. And they're like, what are you doing? And you're like, I'm so fucking sorry. And you're like, wait, don't actually do it. <laughs> no, I know. I don't want to do it either. I'm fucking like, just fucking, we can make it work. Please. It's like the end of Alpha Dog. You're like, you're like fucking every yeah. breakup. Is, every breakup's the end of Alpha him? Dog. Didn't they kill him with like an AK 47? You just scar facing it. Go, <laughs> No, they could have just beaten them up and be like, "All right, we're suburban. We're selling weed in the suburbs." Oh, dude! Someone took it there, dude. Fucking blast! Someone had an AK. Yeah, dude. Someone got real, real. Those got kids real, must real. have been the fucking worst in real life. Oh, I'll tell you what, they had money, so they're just like, "Oh my god!" They probably had this voice. What's up, bro? Oh. Uh, How are you guys going over to Dyson? I've been watching The Sopranos <laughs> recently. Even The Sopranos, I'm like, "What a bunch of fucking assholes!" I watch oh. the show now. I'm like, "These guys suck." Yeah. He's yeah. like, put the ice back in the machine. Like, hits a guy with a brick. I'm like, these guys fucking are the worst, dude. <laughs> they just beat up people and take <laughs> their shit. The fuck out of <laughs> and then they're like, but I'm conflicted about it. Yeah, yeah. And they're like, oh, that's where we're at? <laughs> that was the fucking, like, no, man. But I want the best like, for my daughter. Man, but I, I like the ducks. Oh, <laughs> so, like, ducks. so that's why we like you? Because I had a panic attack. <laughs> oh, so mental health affects bad guys? And we're like, oh, guys, don't. He's borderline personality yeah. disorder. Yeah, oh, I've been having God. a hard time yeah. with that show. Dude, breaking up with someone, man. No, it sucks, dude. It's like, it's not I did it over Skype, <laughs> did and she really? kept going, please don't do oh. this, and you're like, <laughs> oh, God, I, I tapped out. I go, all right, let's try to make it, it that noise. It's like, <laughs> <laughs> dude, <laughs> all right, all right, all right, see ya, see ya. I'm going to go this time. Well, the weirdest is like the post, like almost breakup behavior. They get on like the super good girl and you're the whole time just like, you're trying your best. You're like, yeah. it's not going to work. Oh, oh, dude. oh, dude, the best. I mean, well, the oh. best part of that was I didn't break up with the girl and Vecchio and my friend Graham were in the living room and I came out and they're like, did you do it? And I was like, we're going to try to work it out. <laughs> <laughs> like, I, couldn't, I couldn't cut my arm all the way off. Oh. And then, dude, this is the best. Like three days later, she calls me up and she's like, I think we should break up. And you're like, did you just, you can't fire me, I quit? Yeah. Damn. I was like, but it was almost like, all right. Yeah, that's actually, that's the best case scenario. And we met up for coffee and she tried to be like super serious about it. 
we met up and she goes I think you have a dependency on marijuana. And I was like, yeah, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. What? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, my God. Yeah, totally. Like, yeah, like a lot. <laughs> like, a, like nonstop. And she's like, yeah. I'm glad you recognize that. <laughs> it was one of those. So she just ate they it. Have, <laughs> yeah. They have to hit you with a fucking like real hard analysis. of like, I, when, I, when I got divorced with my ex-wife, she like called my parents like, your son suffers some depression. And they're like, okay. Yeah. Hope it works out for yeah, you. For sure. Like that. For sure, yeah, for sure, he does. I was just like, <laughs> we all do. Yeah, she's like, I just want you to know this. My mom's like, all right, thanks. See ya later. Bye. Yeah, have a good one. <laughs> yeah, I pulled that. They'll hit you with I the just, analysis. I did hit the fucking analysis. I was mad. Hit you the analysis, to. and then the next day, I was like, sorry about the analysis. I didn't Dude, I you're, you're great. I yeah, like, did right, it no on a Netflix special. I can never pull that back. Damn. I've texted that girl like, can we get coffee? I need to apologize for just fucking. Yeah. Reading your rights, just being like, "Oh yeah, I hit it." It Dude. was it was my hit him up. Yeah, yeah. Dude, I, I fucked your I, bitch. Yeah, you we talked about this, fuck. and yeah. I'm like, "Yo, I need that. I yeah. need to hit that." And then oh, I'd feel bad, but yeah, just getting up there and being I'll like, "Tell you what, yeah, I did it." Sack of shit. I, I like I was hurt so bad that I mm. did it all the way through filming, and it didn't hit me until I saw the edit, and I was like, "Oh shit, <laughs> this is going out." <laughs> oh. Like, and not only is she going to see this, but her friends and her family is going to see this. Yeah. Like. Oh, well. Whatever. It's like you launched a missile, and they're like, it's the wrong coordinates. You're like, <laughs> Dumb. It's, in the air. Yeah, it's already in well. the air. <laughs> I mean, we uh, can call them and let them know it's coming. But. I mean, there's literally nothing that can destroy that from impact. Oh, my God. So that was like the one time where I was like, man, I think I would have, I don't know. I don't know. It happened. Whatever. You yeah. get out. Tried apologizing. She's not having it. Yeah. God bless. We should meet up in my place and talk about this. Sorry about that. <laughs> no, it was, I was even like, can I get you a coffee and apologize? And she was like, yeah, all right. But the, the disinterested was the worst feeling. She was like, yeah, okay, cool. I'll text you next week. And then just never text me. You're like, get to shame. <laughs> to shame. <laughs> you know this game very well. <laughs> yeah, dude, I can't play the game at all. I'm just full it's, fucking it, it panic. Sucks. Because yeah. you think when you get out of a relationship, you're like, oh, now the games are over. And you're like, oh, it's a whole it's worse a game. Weird game. It's a whole nother level, dude. Each time I get out into the adult dating world, it's like from being married, I was like, God, this sucks. Started doing adult dating. I was like, holy fuck, this is even worse than when I remembered. You know what it and is? you get out of that and you're like, my fucking girlfriend sucks. I had to get back in. Like, <laughs> you get back out and you're like, oh my God, now I'm in 40 year old dating world. <laughs> it like, really. It always is like the way we would like <laughs> scary. It's always the way like older people talk about like if I could go back to oh, high school. Dude. Like when you're in a relationship, you're like if I could be single again, the yeah. things I would do. And then if you don't realize if you had to go back to high school, you would have to take classes. Like you would yeah, have to like, still yeah, suck. Sure. You would like have to go do homework. Because yeah. I think now like if I went back to high school, I'd be fucking way more confident. I like hit on girls, <laughs> yeah. and then yeah. if I went back, I'd just be like, "Oh fuck, this is awful." <laughs> like, I love you. I love you. My sorry. My ex wife actually like made money. She was an accountant, made like like yeah. ninety grand a year. So we had like you know a house. Everything looked nice around us, and I was just like, I'm like so in my head, I'm like, "This is my house." I'm like, I could be getting so much pussy in here, dude. If this is yeah. mine, we got divorced, and it was just like. In my brother's house on an air mattress, like, all right, pussy's coming. I'm gonna move yeah. in. I'm gonna move in with Shane. Yeah. <laughs> Things are gonna take off. You go step so out. I like drive her BMW. Like, I'm fucking rich, dude. There's no way I should be knocking any pussy right now. That's so funny. Is your wife's credit card? <laughs> yeah. you go, I'd be putting hotels on this shit. We'd be staying at five star resorts. Yeah. <laughs> Just my surroundings are so it. nice, and I'm like, all right, time for pussy. And she'd be like, no, and I'd be like, what? In my head, I'm like, dude, what? all of this, what? dude. Are you kidding me? All this? You guys had a sick TV. We did, yeah, I bought the TV. I was yeah. I did buy that. Yeah, did we, you have to leave it behind? She took it, yeah. yeah. She took it and did like some shit being like, well, the TV is... Wor-, like the TV was still... How did this work out? She was buying the TV off me, but she also... The car was in her name, but I, I paid all the bills and she paid for the car. But then she was saying the car didn't depreciate at all. <laughs> so when I, had to, I had to buy it back off her for like full fucking purchase value. And I was like, all right, but you, let's take the TV off. She's like, oh, the TV depreciated. It's worth like a thousand. It was like a four thousand dollar TV. She's like, it's worth maybe twelve hundred bucks. And I'm like, my Civic's worth eight grand right now. Though? Yeah. She's like, well, that's you know, that's what it is. Kelly Blue. Book. Oh, it's a, it's a Civic. It's a Civic. It's Honda. A, Honda. Honda builds Honda, a good car. Japanese. I was just like, same thing. Like, all right, whatever it takes, whatever you want. Just gave You're it just all. Just getting it out. Yeah. Oh man, it's just fucking brutal. It's all a right. cycle though. Here's here's something.